Hey everyone, this is Grant with Spark Sites with a mid-month update. I've got to do this update for you guys. Um, I've been getting a ton of these questions and before you see something out there that might be misinformation um, or see something that happens in your website that might be misinformation, we wanted to jump in and do a quick education on something you might be seeing a lot of and that's SSL. Um, so real quick, what is SSL? In short, when you go to a website and it's got the green little padlock and the site says HTTPS, instead of HTTP, I don't know if you've ever noticed that, um, but if you have, that means your site is SSL secure. So it is, SSL is a secure socket layer. What that simply means is that there's a little code on your website that acts like a key, and there's a little code on the server that acts like a lock, and it unlocks the content, but the whole time went encoded. And so basically what SSL does not do, and this has come up a few times, is it doesn't, it does prevent hackers from viewing secure info. So if you're selling stuff on your website, you might have this information going from your website to say, for example, PayPal, and credit card information is flying, and when that clock ticker goes, you know, like, like processing transaction, it's sending passwords and credit card info and secure info across the internet. So it's usually mainly only when you're doing uh, e-commerce that you really need it. But as I want to show you, uh, the other thought that has come up in several questions that have happened is, is like, hey Grant, I'm getting some spam comments on my blog. SSL does not block comments on your website. It does block hackers, but when you get spammy comments on your blog, that's not a hacker. It's someone manually going in there and putting in spam, or they've got a robo thing just clicking in and putting in spam. So I know it can be confusing sometimes, but that's not what SSL does. SSL basically codes everything that is leaving your site and going to PayPal or MasterCard or something like that, and it's coding it so only they can read it. But here's the big one that I do want you to hear. SSL does affect your Google search ranking. Only in the last six months has, and I mentioned this in one of the previous videos, Google's been rolling out updates to the Google search algorithm, and if you use Chrome as a browser, you might go to a website and it might say, this website not secure. Is the website not really not secure? No, the web, that notice is coming up for a lot of websites that simply don't have SSL. Along with that, over half of all search results right now, as of, I say right now, as of last week when I was looking at the data, over half of all websites that come up as search results now are HTTPS, AKA, they have the SSL certificate layer. So what, where's this all going? Eventually, all websites will be, by default, SSL secured. Your ranking will begin to go down if you don't have SSL, even if you do not do e-commerce. If you're just an information website, your Google ranking will still over time eventually go down. So what are you to do? How we're solving this at Spark Sites is simply this. We can roll out SSL for everyone very affordably, $20 a year. There are free solutions for SSL, but A, they're unreliable. B, we have to find the code that ends up on the server, find the code that ends up on your domain, install both, which you'll probably hire us to do for $25 an hour, and you're in it for 50 bucks that year, and then we'll have to renew it next year. Or we've got a product that I'll actually link down at the bottom or link in the video somewhere. We'll put a link. Um, and uh, Susan Hokinson from Oh For Goodness Cake, she got one of these. Many people have already started looking at this. We'll put a link in there to actually, if you care, um, it doesn't matter that much right now, but it will in the near future having an SSL certificate uh, on your website. So we'll do that for 20 bucks a year for you guys. Super easy for us to implement for you. Just know that that's coming. Do your own homework. Double check me on my facts. But generally, this is what's going on. So no, it doesn't uh, block comments, but yes, it does affect your Google search ranking and it does prevent hackers from stealing info from an e-commerce site. So that's my spiel on SSL. Give us a buzz if you have any questions at all or email us. We'd love to serve you guys. Keep kicking butt out there and have a spark day.